We're very excited uh, for our local young entrepreneurs to be here at the downtown market here in Manio. We hope that through this program, the market, we help kind of like a mentor and we help give these young entrepreneurs like a toolbox of skills, whether that be networking or resources or ways to problem solve, but also just to know we're here to support them and encourage them. My name is Haley Hurd. My name is Brianna Wader. My name is Alexa, and I am one of the co-founders of Crafty Cranes. And I am a member of Crafty Cranes. I'm part of the business of the Crafty Cranes. My sister got really into making paper cranes. I just absolutely fell in love with the art form. And I was also into making crafty stuff by knitted items. So my sister saw what I was doing and she was like, you know, you could sell these. So me and my sister, we planned to make this store. After that, we recruited our friend Haley and the rest is kind of history. I technically joined the business, the Crafty Cranes. I overheard them talking about this business and I was like, oh my gosh, I've always wanted to start a business. I figured out making jewelry was easy enough, so then, yeah, kind of went from there. So our downtown market that we're doing with the town of Manio, they helped us, like, have a place to sell our things. The town of Manio has definitely helped us a lot. We had our first market here at the waterfront. Manio also has a great community with a bunch of crafters and a bunch of friends. Our community is really supportive, and so the Mania Markets really help to support and just ensure our business's success. My name is Warren Bunce, and I my business, I'm running a lemonade stand. I wanted to start my own business so I could save up and make put it into college, start off at the right track for the future and stuff, and I have my own garden. Uh, for lemons. I wanted to see how they like it. I like to see people enjoy it when they try my lemonade. But with the market, it's really helped me like with my social developing skills with people. I used to be really shy and I don't really talk to people a lot, but now I do. My name is Carly Paramore and I run Clay by Carly. My grandmother was really into jewelry making and so I would sit down with her and make jewelry. I was the only one that really messed around with her jewelry. And so I just started putting it together, formulated my own style and materials that I like to work with and that's how it started. Um, it's actually my dad. I didn't like the business aspect of it because talking to people kind of makes me nervous a little bit. I had so many pieces that he was like, you need to get rid of this. I already knew Michelle, so I had talked to her about joining the farmer's market, and this is my second year doing this now. So the Manu market has definitely helped my business by being able to meet new people and build relationships with customers. The most rewarding part about owning my business is probably that I get to see that people are interested in what I do, because I never really thought that people would like what I do, but it's definitely cool to see when they're interested in like, you know, wearing your jewelry. The most rewarding part of having a small business, I'd say, is the communication skills that I've gained. The communications between me and my business partners that really helped um, me learn like how to compromise on things and things like that. So the most rewarding part is definitely watching it grow. Every time we come to the market, we have something new. Every year, well, it's only our second year, but we've expanded so much and our online business is really going great. And obviously here it's insane. We have our social media presence that's slowly growing and it's just, it's fun to watch numbers go up. <laughs> I have to say like coming here with my friends every week because it's something that I don't get to do a lot with them. My sister has graduated and my friend, I like never have classes with her for some reason. Um, so I never get to see either of them anymore. So it's really nice to just come here every Saturday and like be together and people see my products and are like, I love this. The most rewarding part is Probably the safety knowing that I have some money from this stand so that I could just in case something happens. And I like making people happy and stuff with all my lemonade. If there are any other young local entrepreneurs out there who would love to be a part of the downtown market, you can just give the town of Mania a call. You can call me, Michelle Bunce. I work in conjunction with Tammy Bachelet, who is the downtown market manager. And we will be happy to sit down with you, talk to you about the market, 
how it operates, and we would love to have you. So please just give us a call. You can contact the town. It's 252-473-4101.